All right, so one of the questions I got about the Zbrush 4 iPad is how many millions of polygons it can handle. Uh, so what I'm going to try to do in this video is crash the Zbrush 4 iPad um, just to see if we can do it. But honestly, it is totally fine. Uh, when I was working and doing the beta testing, I got to 30 million polygons and it's totally fine. And usually I don't go for more than that, um, and especially if I have subdivision level. So let's go ahead and try that with this guy. So currently I have 500,000 in total points uh, because a lot of these things are very simple and I'm using subdivision level. So I want to take the, the head of this creature, right? And I'm just going to go ahead and let's go to the subdivision uh, palette right here. I'm going to subdivide it a couple of times. So now I have 8 million polygons in just this little bit on this head. Let's go ahead and select the, the cape. And I want to go ahead and apply the subdivision level. Um, let's do that. And now I have, let's go ahead and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So now the, the cape or that clothing has um, 9 million polygons. So I have now a, a total of 18 million polygons. Let's go to the body and let's go ahead and do the same thing. I'm going to apply the subdivision level. So I have four. Let's go ahead and divide a few more times. So now in the body, I have 5 million polygons. Uh, let's go. All right. So we just hit the, the, the limit and the undo history, but it's still going to do it. So let's just wait until it does it. Million, uh, 20 million polygons. So we have... 20 million polygons on the body. We have uh, whatever it was on the on the on the face. 8 million polygons, and that cape has uh, about 10 million polygons, right? So, in total, 38 million polygons. They all have subdivision levels, and it works totally fine. So that's what I'm saying. There's not like a, a number or a limit. You can just try it out. In my in my opinion, and based on what I've tested, there's like it's not an issue. I don't even worry about like how many polygons I can have. There's going to be a time where I go overboard and it start to sluggish or start to move like really slow. And then I just knock it out uh, or, or send it to, uh, to the computer and continue. But as you can see, it's pretty, it's pretty nice uh, to work with 40 million polygons and so easy. All right. So hopefully this helps.